Hello and welcome to Imagine Books My Photo Creation Software. In this video we're going to look at backgrounds, borders and filters. So starting with backgrounds, you click on the background tab here and you can see that the software comes with a number, a large number of pre-supplied backgrounds. Now if you don't like a background you put in, you simply right click, edit and remove the background. I actually like black backgrounds, I'm going to run it as a two page spread here. Quite a nice effect and our finished product looks great with solid blacks. The other way to do backgrounds is to use your own images. So for example we could take this image here, drag it in there and run it as a two page spread background. The first thing I notice when I put a background like that in is that it detracts from the photos in front. So we've got a few options available. One by right clicking I can choose to fade the background. Fade it away a little bit, automatically enhances the photos at the front. fade it a little further, enhances the photos a little further. Now we can also use borders to further enhance those photos. So if you click on the borders tab you'll see that again we come with a number of borders available, different colors, different thicknesses. Simply drag and drop the border around the image. And yet further enhancement for the photos at the front. Now with regards to filtering you may decide perhaps not with flowers but with some other projects that some photos might look better in black and white and others might work well in sepia. Lots of choices and of course if you don't like it simply remove the filter.